everybody thank you so much for tuning in my name is african millennial and today i wanted to talk about ghana nigeria needs to learn stuff from each other ghana nigeria need to study each other to improve each other's countries all right nigeria needs to learn from ghana to invest better into their education systems because giant of africa but people are leaving nigeria to go elsewhere to study that has to change the education system in nigeria is far far behind for a country of that size their education system should not be the way that it is okay 400 billion dollars annual gdp what are you doing with that money somebody really needs to look into these education systems of Nigeria. That's one thing that I think um, Nigeria can learn from Ghana. What can Ghana learn from Nigeria? Ghana needs to learn how to also invest into their artists of the movie sphere. Ghana, Gollywood needs to learn from Nollywood. Not necessarily by the plays and the screenwriting, but how Nigeria got their entertainment to the outside world that they could consume, Ghana needs to learn how to do the exact same thing. I know Ghanaians like to do their music in tree, Gollywood, which is usually in tree, you know, the Kumasi, Hollywood, which is usually in tree, I get that, but Ghanaians need to learn how Nigerians did that so that there could both be Gollywood and Nollywood and the forefront and that the entertainers in Ghana wouldn't feel like they're not getting any support because Ghanaians, I think, kind of support their own artists but they don't support their artists to the point where it gets international uh, recognition and I'm not saying international recognition as, as in terms of getting Grammys, getting Oscars but at least letting these Ghanaian artists and these Ghanaian actresses and actresses make names and be names that everybody knows about. Everybody knows about Whiskey. Everybody knows about DeVito. A lot of people know about Tiwa Savage. A lot of people know about Burner Boy. The exact same thing I think needs to happen in the Ghanaian entertainment industry. If it doesn't happen, then you'll see a lot of Ghanaian artists go to Nigeria and that that shouldn't be happening, okay? You shouldn't have to go to Nigeria to make it. So whatever Ghana is doing, they need to do a better job. How many times Ghanaian artists have complained that Ghana does not invest enough into their musician artists. Ghana doesn't think that the creative um, side of things is important, but it really is. Even if you look at the fashion industry, the kente market should be dominated by the Akans, not even just by any Ghanians. It should be dominated by the Akans. I don't know if it is, so that's something that Ghana needs to learn. Nigeria should learn how to do better marketing like Ghana is doing. Ghana has been doing some amazing marketing, year of return and other things like that in which Ghana is getting a lot of just doors open for them. As small as they are, they are, you know, becoming a worldwide name. So I think Nigeria needs to start understanding that just being Nigeria is not going to cut it. You need to be friendly. People, you need to control your news stations. You need to control the type of stuff that comes out of your country. You know, so Nigeria and the Nigerian government need to understand that the image of Nigeria it does not look too good and that's something that Nigerians need to change. They need to find a way to make sure that they reverse those images because if they don't help those images, no one is going to want to work with Nigeria. So they need to understand that all of these things that are happening in Nigeria is really hurting the country's brand. Something that Ghana can learn from Nigeria, I think, is how to deal with inflation how to deal with the rising costs of so many things in Ghana because it's not good if you think about it. Accra is not that beautiful to have some of these houses that cost way too much money. Lagos is good. Lekki 
is good. Banana Island is good. So I think Ghana needs to learn how to have this market that isn't so inflated. And just how Lagos and how Lekki, how Banana Island, how Calabar, how all of these wonderful cities are beautiful, but they're also cheap enough to invest in. So I think personally, that's one thing that Ghana can learn from Nigeria. Another thing I think that Ghana can learn from Nigeria is um, business. You know, I think the business practices in Nigeria, they've been clouded by all of this propaganda of 419, blah, 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 blah. But at the end of the day, Nigeria, I think, is West Africa's business capital. So Ghana should learn Nigeria's business sphere and actually see what they can take, what is good, what is bad, and how they could not necessarily replicate it, but understand what would be possible for their own business sphere. Is there is a city I, or a city, I think a state in Nigeria where they make Nigerian made products in Nigeria and they have their own manufacturing practices. So that's something that Ghana can definitely take away from Nigeria. Another thing Nigeria can learn from Ghana maybe is the investment into the electricity sphere because I've heard many Nigerians say that electricity in some parts of Nigeria is really horrible. So I wouldn't say that Ghana's the best, but Ghana's doing better in Nigeria in terms of that so that's something that Nigeria can learn from Ghana. What I think Nigeria can learn from Ghana is about Ghana's democratic sphere, maybe how to have more, I guess better elections, more or less dramatic and less uh, confusing elections. I think that's something that Nigeria can learn from Ghana. As I'm doing this video, I'm realizing that there's so many different things that Ghana can learn from Nigeria and Nigeria learn from Ghana. In any case, I'll cut it short for right now. But what I wanted to say is it's imperative that both countries learn from each other, okay? I understand why Nigerians gravitate towards Ghanaians and why Ghanaians gravitate towards Nigerians. We are two Anglophone West African countries. I believe we are the biggest Anglophone West African countries in West Africa. So it makes sense why we gravitate towards each other. Some people say in order for Africa to unite, all of West Africa has to unite. I'm starting to think that maybe Anglophone West Africa should try to unite and then once that happened, I believe that Africa and West Africa could come in and then it could be United West Africa. I'm starting to think that should be the case because clearly Ghana doesn't really want to work with the Francophone West African countries and clearly Nigeria doesn't want to work with the West African Francophone countries. So the Anglophone countries should just come together, do their own thing, and then Francophone could come in and it could be United United. But in any case, thank you so much for joining this video. This video was about what Ghana can learn from Nigeria and what Nigeria can learn from Ghana. And even though we're doing this competition, I hope we actually understand that we need to learn things from each other because that is the only way that our region is going to advance. That's the only way that West Africa will liberate itself and be where it needs to be. Ghana and Nigeria have serious problems, but I think if Ghana and Nigeria look at each other and realize, oh, this is what you're doing, how did you do this? Oh, that's what you did. How did you do that? I think that is the way in which things can be better. Instead of being jealous and bitter, let's actually look and see, oh, okay, this is the solution. This is how we advance our countries both together, especially as the top two countries in West Africa in terms of uh, popularity, in terms of so many things. That is what we need to do. It is our responsibility to carry each other look at each other and help each other so thank you so much for being here please like let me know what you guys think what did i miss i know i missed some things but this will be a part one so let me know what else you think ghana nigeria can learn from each other and i'll see you guys with another video topic Bye bye